the GPU clock speed was significantly lower. So, I mean, just overall, that thing was horrible, but people bought them left and right because they were like 199 bucks, and it was like, oh my God, it's not that much better. I mean, if you had just spent another 199 bucks on top of that, yes, I know it's a bunch, but holy fuck, what a difference you would make. Yeah, you have to remember, my, my name is not Chimera. I'm not Daddy Warbucks. Oh, well, I get it. <laughs> That's what credit cards are for. Oh, no, I, I stay away from them because all I do is get myself in trouble with them. Uh, Chimera dropped a hint at how much money he was making, and it's a, definitely a nice round number. <laughs> What you're saying is he has disposable income. Yeah. I mean, he did drop the hint it would be making just another 30000 a year. Well, he can dispose some of that income right my way. Nothing we can't handle. I don't have to have the conversation with him again about keys. If that was something you needed, do you think I would tell you? If it's here, I'll find it. So, Saad, you're telling me that, you know, instead of the 3060, you would go in the 3070, and it is, it is bad. That could be a key. Well, let me do some check out. Hey, over here! Let's move! Still relax, mostly. Switch the 3060 on the right to the 4060. It's actually shit. Shit, which makes no sense whatsoever. So 
if I go back to all right so according to this effective speed the tw well, better than I uh, 3070 is 49 percent faster than a 3060 average score 56 percent faster much better lighting effects much better reflection hammering faster multi rendering much faster in body calculation over clock score much better peak lighting effects Reflections, everything. 70% better reflection, 66 better lighting, 42. And we're talking about one and two, right? A 16 and 70. We're not talking about AMB versus media. We're talking about. Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, you might if you try again now, later. what's crazy, I, I, it said superseded by the 4060, so I clicked on the 4060. And the 3070 versus the 4060, the 3070 is still 23% faster effective speed. 30% average score. So it's fucking crazy. Let's go. <laughs> That's just funny. The only thing the 4060 will gain is the fact that that new VLSS 3.5, if you're using any of the new games that are supporting that, 40s have in their AI a new feature called frame generation, which is, since it's AI, it can kind of think ahead. Well, if you're running down that hallway, that end of the hallway is coming, so it goes ahead and tries to go. And that's supposed to be making a big difference, but, um, but you can see right here, I mean, the 3070 is going Now, every yeah. it changes, my son just bought the 4070 Titanium now. It's uh, double the price. According to this, 420 for a uh, 3070. 800 for a 4070, right? Okay, but the 4070 is 62% faster than a 3070. 94% faster in average score. I understand that. However, I do not make NVIDIA 4 Series money. <laughs> so. No, no, it was just kind of interesting to see that 3060 to 3070. 70 is, is, is a great buy. It's much faster than the 60. But then when you look at the 70, you'd have to double your money to get almost double the prop. Uh, you know. Yeah, I got you. Hey, and this is why I asked the questions. Okay, check this out. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta put this back. Hold on. I was like, oh my god. But no, okay. So according to this, and I don't believe it, it's when I have 3060 versus the 4060. The 4060 is 21 percent faster, effective speed, 22 average score, and 31 over clock score. So the 3070 is still the better buy. And I'm sure they're going to be. Let's see what I still have. You continue to fight. Flash combo deals, limited time only. Don't wait, buy today. Nice Let's see, Zotac's got an 8 gig one for 379. Gigabyte's got one for 399, normally 499. I bought a 1060 for one of my employees back in 2019. Refurbished, it looked like a brand new one. And this says refurbished 3078 gig for 349. Hell, an MSI refurbished for 329. Yeah, 3080s or 599 and that, which sucked because I paid 849 for mine. And if I just waited three months, I could have got a 4070. I 
Okay, so me and my son both had 3080s. He recently sold his and got this 4070 tie. According to this, the 4070 tie is 30% effective speed passer, 39% average score. Yeah. And something else that was really wicked. So, <clears throat> think of this, this is pretty wild. When I got to looking at the, what is the physical difference of a 40 and a 30, the 40s are about six to 900 megahertz faster on their turbos. So like where mine's like 1980, theirs is like 2700, like 2.7 gig instead of 1.9. I can take mine up to 2010, which is two gigahertz, but like I said, they're, they're coming from the factory at 20, 26, 27, 2800. Okay, well, if you look at the memory, one of the things they're bitching about is the memory <clears throat> transfer bandwidth is horrible on the 4070 Ti because it's only 192 bit. The, uh, I'm not sure, I think, but yeah, in fact, the 70s got more bandwidth. It's like 256, and then I think the 80s are 384. Well, I was looking at all the specs, and I went, well, it absolutely doesn't matter because, okay, yeah, their GPU is 7, 800 megahertz higher, um, and their memory is, is about uh, two, 300 megahertz faster. But then, wait a minute. Let me look here. According to the, your stats, you're saying that your same memory, a clock higher, is only because of 192 bits can only transfer 512 megabits a second, and mine can transfer 940 gigabits a second. So I'm almost double the transfer speed. Well, okay. So then it means it, it's it's not memory. The performance is the actual cores and the and the higher speed in them. The memory being faster, you know. Well, I guess they had to bring it up to get it to 512, but it really doesn't matter that mine's at 940 because I'm still that much slower than them. You know what, what did I just say? 27 percent.